we are the crane couple and we've got another awesome japan crate unboxing for you today we have the november gacha gacha crate yep that's right full of gacha porn straight from japan the kita kita crate very cute <laughs> full of cosmetics makeup things like that also straight from japan yep we've done a lot of these unboxings before and there's always a lot of good stuff in there First off, we'd like to thank Japan Crate once again for providing both of these crates in exchange for our honest and unbiased reviews. We enjoy a lot of stuff from Japanese culture and so far everything's pretty much lived up to our expectations. Oh yeah. I think so. If you want to pick up your own Japan Crate, we do have an affiliate link that you can use down in the description below. And we also have a coupon code that you can use at checkout. Save a few bucks and it helps support us a lot too. Yeah. Without further ado, Let's dig in! Let's go! We're gonna start off with the Gacha Gacha crate. We reviewed one a couple months ago and we loved it. Yes. Because Gacha Pon. Yes. Because Japanese Gacha Pon's pretty awesome. Brittany, you wanna open it up? Uh, yeah. Alright, go for it. Bam! So, where do we begin, Brittany? Uh, let's do this one. Nice. Okay, it's got green. There we go. Nice. <laughs> Oh, it looks like uh, Fruits Basket characters. Oh, yeah, sweet. All right, well, which character, though? Hmm. Shigure. That's really good pronunciation right there, Brittany. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Let me open him up. Get him out of that plastic. He's the uh, puffa, right? Yes, he is the dog. He's very goofy, but he's got a dark past. Ta-da! And he's also very adorable. Cute little keychain. Yeah. It's one of those like rubbery ones, right? Yeah, it's like bendable. Cool. That way, uh, it should be like fairly sturdy, things yeah. like that. I feel like I see a lot of anime keychains that are kind of built with this same kind of material, but it's very cute. Super deformed, as always, because chibi. Yeah. Chibi he's stuff cute. is the cutest. Very cute. Which one would you like? I'm going to open this one. Oh, it's got. Oh no, there's like paper that was actually Little caught bits in the tape. on it. I have no idea what this is. It's big. Isn't Gachapon tape the worst? <laughs> it is. This is, oh, the Sylvian families. It's those cute little animals. Oh. We, we'd see them in like the gem pushers yeah. and stuff. But it's like an extra like it's micro a, it's one. It's so baby. Can you build it? You can. So it's like a house, which is also a carrying case Aww. kind of thing. But then there's all the little bits inside. You need my scissors? No, no, I got It's got a pony. You should be able to enjoy it without a blade. <laughs> you can take off the little paper from the, not really a pamphlet or booklet or whatever, but the little paper that's always included. The, with the this little gotcha pond paper. I'm going to try to fold this as even as I can. <laughs> Boom. So you just, you, you put it inside. Yeah. But probably better than I do. No, you could. Oh my it's, gosh, I feel like you need tweezers for whatever that little yellow thing is. It's so tiny. How do I do this? Yeah. It's turning around. Oh no. No, no, there. no, 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 no. Okay, almost. What is that little yellow thing? I was going to say a fire hydrant, but <laughs> I don't think that's what you put in the house. It's cute, Brittany. Oh, that's super cute. That's really adorable. So yeah, it's uh, set up your own little house right there. Bam, look at that. Look at that focus. Wow, that is actually really cute. And that's also kind of tricky to put that, that together. <laughs> that's a lot in one little gotchapon, though. Very cool. That is Aww. That's probably the most work I put into a gotchapon <laughs> since that fan. <laughs> this one! Is that Mario related? It, I was about to say, it looks like it's got some Mario stuff in there. Huh. Hold on, I gotta battle this tape. I still, I still can't tell what it is. It looks like a giant yellow plastic bit. What is that? I think it's a game. It's a definitely, what? it's Super Mario. Bowser Bam. on there? Yeah. There you go. Bam. Yeah, I got, I got bad bros. Oh. oh, you can actually move the little, yeah. uh, oh, how cool. And then you get the little tokens on this side. <gasps> I'm glad we're not building this out on a public street or something. We would have lost right. all of it. I got him. Eh. Push that in there. As close as, as close as I can make it. So now it looks like that. Yeah, it's got little wings now. Whee! You put one on, you put it on the left side. Yes. And then you try to, it's like a puzzle kind of thing. You work your way out. It's got the little flipper. Okay, I can't do this showing you this. <laughs> no, no, you won't be able to see it that well anyway. Eh. Ah. Oh. No! <laughs> 
Yeah, so it's like one of those little puzzles where you have to move the ball around to ah. get to the end spot, but it's with little coins. It's like old school carnival games, you know, you gotta like roll the ball down very carefully. How do you do that spot? <gasps> she did it. From here. Yes. You just gotta pop it into the... Boom! Yes. I did it! No cheating. No hacks. <laughs> just skill, guys. That's cute. I can't believe that was in the Gachapon capsule. These are some complicated Gachapon. And here I thought Gachapon was just about keychains. Yeah. So if you thought that was a lot, well, there's still half the crate left. Yes. Hmm. Which one you want? Uh, I'm gonna try this one. It's a little smaller than the other ones. Hmm. I think it's gonna be a lot less complicated. Well, I'm hoping for it. <laughs> Bam! Oh, is there a there's a little guy in there. Oh, uh... Oh my gosh, I forgot what his name is. Kanahei. It's, it's a funny, like, bunny character. There's lots of plastic. They never skip on the plastic with the <laughs> It's this dude. It's this cute little... Yeah, yeah, I've we, seen him. We've seen him all over, all over the place in Japan, but uh, apparently called Kanahei. I mean, we didn't really like look for it when uh, we were in Japan, but we definitely saw a lot of him regardless. Yeah. Holding a little rice ball. Beep, beep. Is that his butt? Uh. Oh, it's his feet. His feet and a tail. Yeah. <laughs> I only saw two bumps on my side, so I thought it was a butt. Was everything a butt to you? <laughs> I mean, it's technically <laughs> his butt. True. Very cute little keychain. Yeah, it's got the little, oh, little I like clip that. right little... there. You can hook it onto something. Cool. Huh? He's cute. He is adorable. And he also likes food, which I identify with. Yeah. Mm, that's one. Hmm. It's a brown lump. I think it's Eevee. <laughs> oh, no. It's funny Eevee. <laughs> it's lumpy Eevee. It's going to suffocate if you don't get the plastic off. I got you. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> well, Evie's been rescued. It's missing ears. I, I just like this. <laughs> it doesn't look right at all. <laughs> Bunch of evolutions you could have gotten. Or a Pikachu. Or a Pikachu. Not bad. I think you got a good one. Though. I'll take Evie. Normal Evie. Evie's cute. Evie would be cuter when you put the rest of <laughs> his or her body on. You can make Bam! A twist and shout. Well, that is a cute Evie for sure. Of course it had to be something Pokemon related in this yeah. Gacha Gacha crate, right? Very nice. It's an adorable Eevee. It's got a big head and you can turn it like so. <laughs> adorable. Yeah, that's cute. You got a good one. Just kind of complicated to put together. It doesn't look like it would be, but it be complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Last, but certainly not least, We've got da, da, da. a rice ball. Yay! <laughs> it's actually like a rice ball. That's so is odd. That, I want to know, is that how it comes out of the gotchapon machine like that? I mean, it kind of has to, right? How does it? It's supposed to roll. It's so weird. It's kind of flop and tumble its way down, hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Brittany, I've got a surprise for you. Would you to do me the honor of choosing our next <laughs> snack? This rice ball with a little topping. No! What is that? What is that? <laughs> it's just like a black lump. I'm gonna guess it's like uh like a funny seaweed. I'm, yeah, I'm assuming some sort kind of, of seaweed thing. thing. Yeah. No. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh. That's she, cute! She doesn't want my rice ball. <laughs> it's okay. I thought it would be a better topping. I want some proper like furikake <laughs> or something. <laughs> it is cute though and uh, this is a very strange thing to have a ring. It's like an actual like ring box. Adorable <laughs> and also odd. Extremely odd. Boom. Very nice. Well, it wouldn't be Gachapon without some paper instructions. <laughs> Yay! Oh, it's a triangle! Do you, you want to know how big the instructions are? <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, there's so many oh. so many types. Oh, look at that! We could have gotten so many different toppings. And I we got like the that weird, one. Maybe one of you guys got something a little 
a little cooler than a little black mass of stuff, but... <laughs> I've always wanted a diamond ring with black seaweed on it. Wow, this is one of the strangest things I've ever seen. Where do you even find gotchapon like this? Well, that was it for the gotch gotch crate. Next up, a kita kita crate. Yee! Which if you're not familiar with, it's got makeup, cosmetic stuff, kind of, that kind of thing. Beauty products. All right, let's open this up. Bam! Mmm. Of course, we are probably going to need this, uh, brochure. Handy dandy booklet. Ooh, where do we begin, Brittany? That's a lot of stuff. Where should we start? Uh, Hello Kitty and Kiko Masa Lotion. It's a collaboration with Sanrio to bring their best-selling sake high moisture skincare lotion for a limited edition release with Hello Kitty. It has sake, yes, rice wine, and uh, ceramide, a moisturizing agent, hydrate, soothe, smooth, and brighten skin. Suitable for all skin types. Yeah, it says, it says high moist and skin care lotion. I could probably use that. The weather lately has actually it's been so bad that my skin on my fingers actually cracked a bit. So yeah. I'm trying to hide it a it, little bit. It's all around my nails too. Mm. It's how dry it is. It smells kind of sweet. I guess that's pretty fitting of Hello Kitty, huh? Yeah. Huh. Oh. I just put it in my hands. Oh, it's so weird. It it's looks like liquid. It's literally like water. It's kind of like milky too, like the, the color. My hands just feel oily. <laughs> interesting, very interesting lotion. I don't know if it's my favorite, but it looks cute at least. It smells good. Yeah, I mean, it's supposed to be really good for hydrating. Plus, sake. Is sake known for its like skin moisturizing properties? Next up, we've got the Hika Lip. Uh, it's a uh, lip balm. Keep your lips hydrated this fall with this lightly scented mint menthol lip balm. Toss in your bag to have your lips moisturized 24 7 through the colder weather. Well, okay. Considering that it has been pouring the past couple days, <coughs> past couple days here in San Diego. It's cute. The packaging is very nice. Yeah. I like that kind of sheen it's got to it. I will say I don't like that it's mint. I mean, I'm fine with it as long as oh. I don't have to eat it. I mean, if you've watched our previous Japan Crate unboxings, you'll know our disdain for mint candy. It's like super thick. And lips feel sticky. <laughs> <laughs> they look it kind of, it feels like, yeah, I mean, it is, it's gloss lip. It's like, uh, it feels like lip gloss. It's good for moisturizing and for giving your lips a little touch up in the looks department. Exactly. Basically a social media filter right there. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, we've got the Rose Bath Set. It's a facial mask and bath salts. Bathe and relax in the pleasant scent of rose this fall with this bath salt and sheet mask combo scent. After a long day, this combo is the perfect way to end your day, Brittany. Ooh, mm. fun. Yeah, so here's the face mask. Okay. And then right. this is the bath powder. Huh. Oh, <laughs> that's definitely the bath salts right there. Yeah. Ooh. <sighs> Hardcore rose perfumey smell. Maybe dump that in the bath first. <laughs> Smell it later. I mean, it's not a bad. It's not a bad smell, but it's just. It's all. It's the powder is all right here, so it's gonna be very strong. I love that I said that, and then you went right for it. <laughs> it is. It is pretty strong. It does smell nice though. If yes. you're in a like flowery rose scent, uh, that definitely seems nice. I think that would be pretty relaxing. Oh yeah, that'd be cozy. Yeah. And then you've got a mask. Match it. I'm gonna assume. You got some like rose scentedness to yeah. it. Yeah, I'm not gonna open it because it's got like liquid in it and I don't want it to dry out just yet. We'll save it for next time. What do we got next, Brittany? Got. Is that another mask? <laughs> it is, actually. I was looking at the directions on the back. <laughs> oh, I was looking at the like kind of creepy mask on the front. Oh. oh. Uh. You just love that on the packaging of no, all these like, things. Oh. Just... <sighs> well, it's definitely a mask, it's a yuzu facial mask. November is the season for yuzu in Japan. Use the sheet mask for 10 to 15 minutes and keep with the season. Your face will feel fresh and moisturized for fall and thank you afterwards. Hmm. It Seems looks like nice. it would like energize you with right. all the like citrus. Yeah. Very potent. It actually says dessert mask. So I mean I can moisturize and eat afterward? I don't like that it's called a dessert mask but I am down. I like face masks. I think this is the last thing for me. Yep. Definitely not the least. Nope. It's a cap. Yay! <laughs> On the packaging, it actually says, make yourself prettier. 
Well, anything is better with cats, am I right, guys? <laughs> it's a gua sha? A cat design. Super popular and trending beauty tools right now are jade rollers and gua shas. Use this cat shaped gua sha and massage all the curves of your body, including face, stomach, arms, and legs, to stimulate blood circulation and lymphatic flow. What? That is so odd looking. It's just a cat. I mean, from the outside, it looks like a jelly. Yeah, it almost but... looks like a jelly, but it's hard. Oh, it's just plastic? Yeah. Oh, interesting. What do you... Just like rub it on yourself. There's like a flow chart of where you should rub your cat on Wait, your face. Wait, so I go like this. Okay. I don't know how I'm supposed to rub the cat on my face. I'm going to say the, the edge here. I was going to yep. say, you're rubbing the cat's butt on your face. Yep, I'm rubbing the butt on my face. Then Very you go nice. this way. Mm. Yep. How do I do it this way? I don't, <laughs> I don't know how I feel right now. <laughs> A little confused. <laughs> what is getting those small crevices? All yeah. right. Mm -hmm. How do you feel? Now I'm the confused one. Odd? It's because, weird uh, because, like, maybe it's just because I'm, like, like touching spots on my face, but it actually feels like my blood is circulating through those spots where I was. I don't know. It's cute. I'm not totally sure if we're doing it right yet, but uh, it's neat at least. It's a very unique concept. That's for sure. I mean, who else could claim that you could rub a cat's butt on your face and improve your health? Well, that's it for our November Japan crate unboxings, the November Gacha Gacha crate and the Kira Kira crate. Both pretty good overall yes. especially well for me no offense kita kita <laughs> but i kind of like gachapon a little more hmm. but Brittany, do you have a favorite from each of the crates um gotcha gotcha crate i think my favorite is the little uh critter house with uh, little baby figures and stuff in it i would agree i think that was a pleasant surprise because i saw that and i thought it's like a clear plastic Box. Yeah, but then I, I'd actually got the little instruction manual and was like, oh, it's like a little like a little place set yeah. almost. It's really cute, even if it's a little tricky to get them placed in just right. Uh, what about the Kita Kita crate? Hmm, favorite from there would probably have to either be the face masks or the um, lip gloss balm stuff just That's because multiple favorites uh, i'm sorry i like <laughs> both three of them favorites. the face masks are the same thing i like face <laughs> masks it makes my my skin and my face feel nice and soft after true but i also like for especially because it is november my lips get very dry because of all how dry it, it is night right now so don't look at mine i know this is being filmed and uploaded in 4k resolution so you can see how chap my lips you should, you should have put some on i probably should have yeah it's pretty nice even with it being mint at least we don't have to eat it yeah that's I, my main thing i mean thing. i don't really smell it or taste it on so oh, i i can't <laughs> i had to smell it first in case <laughs> what were your not necessarily least favorite what was one that didn't quite live up to your expectations on both of the crates Brittany? i don't really have like a least favorite from the gotcha gotcha crate no nah. I mean, I guess because everything else is so crazy, the two keychains are kind of like, oh, these are cute. A little normal. But everything typical. else is like, yeah, it's a game. Or like, it's a, <laughs> it's a ring case. Or it's a giant Pokemon. Got you a rice ball you, ring, Brittany. You did. I basically proposed right here for all the internet to see <laughs> with a rice ball. <laughs> no, the keychains are fine, but they're probably like on the bottom half just because. They're cute, but they're not really super interesting in that regard, like you said. Yeah. What about the Kita Kita crate? I'm, I think I'm least excited about the Hello Kitty lotion. Because, <laughs> like, I put that on and my hands don't really feel very moisturized. I also think it's kind of weird that it's, like, a liquid. Yeah, it, it looks like water. It's not really, basically. like, a thick lotion. It's almost like a milky liquid. Maybe lotion's I feel a little like it's gonna different drip elsewhere everywhere. or something. Yeah. But for us, I mean, we're used to like, you know, the typical brands that we don't need a list out here, but you rub them in for a few seconds and boom, you're good. And yeah. I don't know. I, I didn't really get that feeling from that lotion. I can see hmm. like if you put it like on a, like a cotton swab or something and you like, you use it for like your face or something, maybe that'll make it better. But 
Maybe. I wasn't really feeling it. I don't know. But more importantly, what did you guys think? Go ahead and comment below and let us know what your favorites or least favorites were from these crates. And again, guys, thank you for watching. If you are interested in picking up your own Japan crate, go ahead and use our affiliate link you see in the video description below. And go ahead and use our coupon code. I believe it is CraneCouple3 and you can save a few bucks off at checkout. And it also helps support us too. Yeah. But thank you very much, guys, for watching. We are The Crane Couple. Don't forget to like and again comment. Let us know what you think about our latest Japan Crate unboxing for the month of November 2019 here. And uh, go ahead. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Lots of other great unboxings and, of course, tons of arcade videos for you guys. And make sure you turn on the bell and make sure you turn on all notifications. That way you don't miss any of our videos as well as live streams. All right? Also, follow us on Instagram at The Crane Couple to keep up with all of our adventures. And... Finally, a huge thanks to all of our patrons as well as channel members. You guys are awesome. Thank you for helping keep us full-time internet content creators. If you want to pledge your support to us, check us out at patreon.com slash couple. Or you can hit that join button that you see on our YouTube page and you can become a channel member. Get access to emojis and all these things you use during live streams. Alright? Yeah. Anyway, see you next time.